Good day, everybody. Today, we'll be talking about how you can earn on GMX by staking GMX and holding GMX's liquidity provider token, GLP. Now, today, GMX and other DeFi protocols have become extremely popular, giving the individual the decentralization, the transparency, as well as the flexibility in order to manage their own assets, essentially empowering individuals to act like their own bankers. Hence our channel's name, DeFi Bankers. Here in today's channel, you will learn how to leverage GMX and other DeFi protocols in coming videos. It would be very nice if you guys could hit a subscribe, leave a comment and let us know, give us feedback about our videos and also what videos you would like us to cover. Yes, GMX is a DEX, also known as Decentralized Exchange, or here a decentralized perpetual exchange where you could use up to 50x leverage trading cryptocurrencies such as BTC, ETH, and Avalanche. Now here we could see that the total trading volume of GMX is $130 billion with a total users of 285,000 people. This is a good indicator of showing that the protocol is relatively, relatively secure and in good hands. Now, some of the things that GMX provides is reduced liquidation risks, saves on costs in transactions, and simple swaps. Now, here we could see that GMX is on two different networks, either Arbitrum and Avalanche. Now, here in this video, we'll show you how to leverage Arbitrum because on Avalanche, the APRs aren't as high with Avalanche sitting at an 8.56 APR compared to 12.64 APR on Arbitrum. As well on the GMX token, it sits at a 3.31% APR on Avalanche and 3.45 on Arbitrum. Now, how do we essentially, and why do we want to buy this token? Now, for one thing is that I noticed on the on for just for some technical analysis that here we could see that there's potentially a double bottom here back in 23 it hit around the same price and it bounced back up doing the same thing and now we might potentially see gmx go back into an uptrend now i'm not saying that it might reach this price 102 dollars within within the next few months but here we could it definitely might get there within the beginning of 2024. Now, how do we measure the price is by taking the top price and make and bring it down to where the support region is, which sits around $59, $61, whatever it is, and bringing it up to the neckline, which it might break out at $103. But this is just for technical analysis and future overview. Now here, how do we buy and stake GMX and GLP? Now GMX and GLP will jump right into GLP first. Now GLP, we could see that we could use by either using Ethereum, USDC, whatever it might be, connected to your MetaMask. So right now I have some ETH. So I'll buy some GLP using some of my ETH. And here we'll put in, I don't know, we could put in some zero one, and then I'll get some $18 by GLP here. Spending cut. Okay. confirm and it looks like i have some glp now here i could see that my glp went up and then as you essentially buy your glp which is connected from your metamask you automatically are holding and staking your current capital now you do not have to worry about putting it somewhere and pressing this button just like gmx gmx is something different Okay, here we could see that the wallet has $35 and it's staked $35 with the current APR 
of 12.65. Now the APRs are updated weekly on Wednesday and dependent on the fees which will be collected for the week. Now, how do we purchase GMX? Now, usually what we like to do is going onto Uniswap, but fortunately for you guys, we found out that Uniswap actually has higher fees than MetaMask. Even though on MetaMask, it doesn't show that we're capable of purchasing GMX, but the way we do this is, let's say I'm holding some ETH right over here. I wanna go on swap and I want to bring in the address of GMX, which sits on CoinMarketCap. If you look up on CoinMarketCap, if you look up on CoinMarketCap, GMX, and then you're essentially going to be able to go to contracts on Arbitrum. You copy the contract, go to MetaMask. You go over here, you click continue. And now you have the GMX contract inside your MetaMask. And now you, let's go transfer some of our tokens. Here, 0, 0.0, whatever it might be. Okay, let's trade some $4 just to show you that the, here we go. We could see that the fees are lower. 43 cents compared to Uniswap's $2.81. Now here we could, there we go. Let's purchase some GMX. And now it's processing. And now we should wait a few moments. And here we go. The transaction has been completed. Now, if we go back, now if we see that now we've added more money into our wallet, okay, by simply copying and pasting the GMX contract, the Arbitrum contract from CoinMarketCap onto the MetaMask and then simply swapping it, which was a cheaper fee compared to Uniswap, we're capable of staking it. Let's go stake our tokens of GMX, zero points. Here, let me try it again. Maybe try it with a smaller amount of money. And here we go. Now we could see that we've made our transaction over here and we have staked GMX. And now in the coming weeks, we'll be able to see our rewards over here and we'll be able to compound them over here, make do a multiplier points and which will come out with another video in the coming future once we are capable of actually leveraging these things. If you guys like the video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Also, leave a comment down below. We'd love to hear your feedback and what you guys would want us to cover in the next video. See you guys later, DeFi Bankers.